is Tallulah and this is my vlog, darling. Ostrich feather hat! Uh, I'm just going to show you at all angles because it's quite impressive. I put this on this morning, darling, you know what I said to myself? I said, Dr. Shivago, and uh, you know, from Russia with love. Anyway, from Russia with... <laughs> love is the question du jour. Aujourd'hui, les gens. Mesdames, messieurs, baby. Today's question is, how can I attract love? Obviously, one puts on one's best foot forward, one's favourite hat, and I tell you, an ostrich feather hat has never let me down in the love stakes. I will say one bad thing for it though, it's very hot, darling, so you don't want to lift your hat up unless it's absolutely necessary. Um, anyway, for today's question, which is all about how can one attract love, I have decided, darling, to call in an expert in the field, dans le champ d'amour. Yes, darling, today we have a very live, alive guru, a love guru, Vish! And we have a, an international, not only is Vish a love guru, he speaks the language of love en français. Oui, c'est en français, oui. Je peux me débrouiller en français, oui. Très bien, Vish, très bien. Vous êtes très belle aujourd'hui. Ah, bah super. Comme d'habitude, oui. Ah, bah comme d'habitude, oh là là. Oh. I'm being rude on my very own vlog, Vish. I hope people are cultured enough to understand. But I know some people that watch the show also wear crocs. So who knows? I oh. bet they can't even say the word bonjour. To I don't mean to be disparaging. To each his own. To each his own. Thank you, Vish. Now listen, what do you say to a question of how does one attract love? How does one attract love or how does Tabula attract love? Darling, we're talking uh, about in love in general. I'm not talking about me personally, myself, and I. Darling, right, okay. totally, you mustn't have read the brief of the show, darling. All right. This is about one in general. One in general. One of the right. so millions that, of lonely, heart throbbed women. All right. Not okay. me, obviously. All right. All right. Let's, uh, let's address that. How does one attract love? It's yep. all about energy. And just as when two people come together and we say, hey, uh, the chemistry worked out, the chemistry doesn't work out, what uh, yogis say behind chemistry is energy. And the quality of this energy is going to determine the quality of chemistry and the quality of person you're going to attract and how long you keep the person. Darling, you're speaking like, are you trigonometry? <laughs> Is that algebra or something? It's more to do with chemicals, really. Yeah, right, 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 I know all about that. I don't do physics, darling, I yes. did do physics. Right, because okay. There was a brief moment after watching Top Gun that I thought I might join the Air Force. All right, okay. Anyway, um, uh, right, so once you, okay, well, I, I mean, I, I'm a little bit bamboozled, darling, by all that. I mean, okay, 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 so let's take the word energy okay. out of that equation. How would one enhance one's energy, for example? Oh, great question. That example. Uh, for example, uh, uh, on peut, on peut uh, changer la nourriture. Well, uh, change those, the food up. Yes. Don't it's eat all, chips. Yeah. So for example, let's just take a simple concept of food. Right. What you put into your body. Can I just say Gandhi never said it was a simple concept. Do you know what Gandhi says about food? Yes. The, about the fork? About no, this, the most dangerous thing? About the, the, the dinner fork is the most dangerous weapon in the world. Yes, Something I agree. Like I, I mean, couldn't the, agree more. Well, there you go, yes. darling. So, yeah. not innocuous. Yes. And we know from science that the food you eat yeah. has a direct bearing on how you think. Oh, well, yes. Couldn't agree more, darling. If you go around eating salami, I don't know what's going to happen. Exactly. Salami or even extreme red meat, for example. So, let's just stick to your... Violence, thing. you're talking about? We're yes. going to have a vegan come in later, darling. Don't right. worry about that. All right. We've got we vegans did. covered. Right. Vegans and violence. Heck. So I should, yeah. Can I it, it, what yogis say is simple. Eat right food so that your consciousness and your energy are right. And then you so meet they, the right person. Exactly. That's as simple as that. It's as simple as that. Yes. And listen, what kind of sandwich? Because we always like to prescribe a sandwich because basically people enjoy sandwiches. Sandwiches. Do you like sandwiches, Vish? Yes. Which holistic holistic sandwich, yes. Holistic sandwich? Yes. I don't, can you eat a holistic sandwich? <laughs> Damn, this is not the philosophy Absolutely. 101. It's this is basic. We are in a kitchen. I mean, right. look, this is a real avocado. Right, it's a We're real avocado. We're not talking about metaphors. Right. But, uh, but real avocado also has vibration and it also has energy right. behind it. A bit a like real a triangle. Apple. Exactly. And what yogis say is make sure your energy and your vibrations are higher. That makes sense, darling. One wants to resonate. Does it help to have a hat? Yes, for somebody like you. Because your I'm, only stature, five foot three, stature, I'm only five foot three. Yes, but so this adds about another half foot. Yeah, but for you it doesn't make any. Because I'm emanating Yes, already. you are emanating like energy. Diamond. We just see the light with you. <laughs> oh, fish! Yes. Like a lighthouse. Yeah. Like a port in the storm. Exactly, yes. Yeah. So I'm here, right here. Yes. And the lighthouse, come to me. Yes. So a bunch of ships are oh, coming and attacking. Not attacking, <laughs> darling! And all the submarines. Like so you have submarines, 
you have submarines? <laughs> I don't mind a submarine. I mean, a submarine sandwich is quite good. No, listen, we need a okay. sandwich. Oh, I'm thinking hummus. hummus. Maybe some chickpeas. Hummus. Oh, no, that is hummus. Um, it, what's that other thing? Pine nuts. Pine nuts. I was also, thinking about. Also, with the fromage? No? I'm not a cheese girl, darling. You're not a cheese girl? No, don't come near me with a fondue. I won't oh, manage that at all. Right. But somebody died once, you know how? From uh -huh. eating fondue and then having ice cream. Because ice cream on top of fondue, the cheese is, is congealed and then death. That's it? Yeah, they don't Plant even put it on the menu. And gone. No, I know, darling. I met someone from Switzerland recently right. and I asked him if that was true. And all he right. said yes, but there's no warnings on a menu. All we right. just have to happenly know that. All right. All right. How about uh, dangerous al cheeses? Almond butter. Almond butter. Yes. yes. But I mean, some people in our, are watching the eat crocs. They wear crocs. They might know, not know about almond um, uh, We're in Los Angeles where you can get almond butter, but there okay. might not always uh, be almond well, butter. Well, uh, then buy a bunch of almonds and just crush it yourself. Crush it yourself. With a mortal and yes. pestle. Soak it and crush it. Soak it and crush it. And let that be a lesson. The recipe yes. should be below. And let's, I just want to say, Vish has written a book, darling. Yes. That's how guru, you know, man writes a book. I mean, there's over 165 pages in this book, all about how to attract love. Yes. Yoga and love. And it's red and you're wearing red. It's easy for you. Today. It's easy for me yes. today, darling. And so for you as <laughs> and well. And there's going to be all the links in the bit below. And 